Funny story. Group seven unlocked. Third time's a charm. It could be the fourth, but who cares? We're not going to let anything stop us from coming through on this because we're asking the moon goddess who sees things through and through that manages, helps us manage our manifestations coming into fruition. We're asking what we particularly have manifested together, what she has to say about that. Okay, so these two cards came together. It's the Nine of Cups. And actually, first the Nine of Cups came in independently, separate. And um, what we're doing here is we're going through a transformative process, each and every one of us, okay? You and I, okay? And um, with that, we're looking at things independently. We're going through this like in a very intimate experience, which means that we need to look at things objectively. Like what creates satiability? What creates satisfaction independently? So in order to take an objective point of view, we're taking like a few steps back, okay? We're not going backwards. We're just taking a few steps back. We're still looking forward at everything. We're looking at this masterpiece instead of just a single facet, like piece by piece, fractionally. We're not compartmentalizing our point of view anymore. We're looking at things in the greater scheme. So this puts things into perspective for a greater art appreciation for like what spirit has in store for us so that when we bring it home, when we bring that together, um, the perspective is more profound. How we address things is uh, more impactful. Okay. So, um, the, this is like the bring home, like welcoming package. We're getting what we want here. Okay. And what following cards came through is, um, saying that like when we're going through this experience, um, we have to prioritize, we have to, we're naturally dropping the conflict. Okay. That sense of competition. Okay. Um, and we're bringing our learnings back home, uh, and so when we start things, this is like the primary card, like this is the centerpiece of it. Um, we can fire things up and still be like chill, like in harmony. Um, no problems. It's, it's just, it, it all works. So knowing that like sometimes like we have to be like stand apart. Okay. It doesn't mean that like our independence creates aloofness. It's more like, Hey, we got to venture out. We know that we um, have family. We still have soul family. Um, and we're still like bonded together, but to venture out for that greater perspective, um, we need to be able to like move out of the house. We need to get out of point place. We need to like move out of the city. Um, and so that's focused intention so that when whatever we bring back home, we're also bringing back to the table. So being so like collectively these cards, um, when we're, when we get what we want, when our ships have come in, um, that it's a shared experience so that like we built